welcome this is the energy vibration um, reading for the Sun Moon and Rising Gemini's and I want to say thank you so much to you guys thank you for your support your likes and shares please keep on leaving the message behind because they're wonderful they're going to help other people to bring positivity in other people's life this is going to be a week of uh, um, achievement uh, but also judgment uh, also you'll be feeling at the beginning of the week as if you're carrying a burden and uh, this sort of a thing but this week is the week of an earth week it is the week of uh, balance and it is a wonderful energy because um, the, the um, zodiac energy is the energy of uh, fire so you are a hair sign and you have earth balance in you and the zodiac energy of fire coming up so you need to find your passion within this week your energy is the four of pentacles so the four of pentacles is wonderful because you're having a wonderful um, balance that is coming in you're having a positive wonderful balance that is coming in you're balancing your financial situation in this week you Gemini so this is good so what is whatever is happening to you Gemini is going to be a wonderful wonderful celebration it's going to be a wonderful situation that is coming in as I break down your week and I'm looking to see what is happening, there is uh, um, um, the major arcana. There are good things happening. Whatever is happening in the beginning of the week, uh, you have uh, um, uh, the energy of uh, the ones, uh, which is you're, you're, you're protecting yourself in whatever way. You are, are ready for anything that is coming at you. You are positive, you're ready, and you're there. The energy of the Empress, uh, the Emperor is here, which is for a lot of people, um, you're going to get promotions. Um, um, if you're looking for a uni university studies and that sort of a thing, it's going to be happening on Tuesday. So whatever the situation is, um, use Tuesday. What we're having is judgment for this week. So whatever the situation is, let's see why the judgment is coming up. And guess what is here in your reading for this week is temperance. So there is a judgment. There's the emperor. There is judgment. And there is the tendency of... Uh, um, um, wonderful um, situations coming in. There is going to be a debt and transformation on Friday. So um, be aware of that. The world energy is on Saturday. So Saturday is going to be a wonderful energies for you. Geminis are in this week because you have two earth signs that is here balancing out. Um, so there is a lot of balancing, hurt energy balances that is going on. You have uh, um, water uh, so you have the hurt and water energies that is happening. There is two fire energy and that is the beginning of the week. There's going to be situation with your work. Let's see what the angels and guides have for you, Geminis. Let's see what is the extra messages because the four of pentacles is here. It's wonderful. It's going to be a good week. Uh, judgment, the seven of swords, whatsoever that has been happening. Um, uh, um, whatsoever that has been happening. The Empress comes back in your energy and you have the nine of pentacles. So wonderful, wonderful. So your focus is the four of pentacles trying to bring balance to your financial situation and here you have the nine of pentacles she is going to bring you wonderful 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 money is coming into you she is going to bring money into you the four of pentacles you're bringing this is your focus the four of pentacles and the nine of pentacles is here and she's going to bring you what money in your life damn ladies and gentlemen it's going to be a wonderful week okay let's break down your week but first of all let's look at your numbers and see the night of the nights are here in your reading so this week there is going to be a focus on the people between the ages of 18 and 35 there is going to be a strong focus um, um, with the people between the ages of 18 and 25. There's going to be a strong focus that is happening. There is a lot of money is here in your reading because I have the four of pentacles. I have the nine of pentacles, which is your energy vibration and focus for this week. But yet still, I have the ace of pentacles, the ten of pentacles, the six of pentacles. So whatever is happening to you, ladies and gentlemen it's going to be a week 
this is the week of money 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 for you guys so let's look at what's happening around for you you have the energy of the nine of what uh, uh, starver the nine of starver is the energy where you are you are protected so no matter whatever comes to you in this week it is going to just bounce off because look at these uh, um, starver the nine of starver is just covering you over and whatever is happening you're protected by your family okay so whatever situation that is happening you're protected by your family so this is going to be a very 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 prosperous week especially on Monday whatever is happening whatever situation that is coming at you your family is going to protect you look at that protection um, the father and the mother protecting uh, the child so whatever is happening know that the universe angels if your parents have passed over they're still protecting you from out the spirit world so this is a perfectly wonderful reading as we go forward on Tuesday which is going to be a fire day and it's going to be a wonderful day of excitement it is going to be a day that you're bringing balance because your focus is the four of Pentacles bringing balance to your financial world and your materialistic world and this is going to happen be aware of who is this person okay because there could be a situation with an Aries this man be aware of your money protect your money from this man because this man is not very honest okay he has been coming up and is a sneaky little thing because that's a girl it can be a man or a woman that is trying to get away with something but they you know and it has something to do with your work so be aware of the people of your work who is of Aries the Aries because the Emperor is the energy of the Aries and the carry the energy vibration of the Leo's so be aware of the Leo's and the Sagittarius also up your work whatever is happening there is a situation that is going on up your work if you're not working there's a situation that going in uh, going on around you that has to do with this uh, Emperor and the emperor can be the energy of a father, and a kid is trying to get away with something. It's not really a kid, but it's someone. So, this energy is for the people between the ages of 18 and 35 that this is going to affect. So, be aware of what is happening in your life. There is a lot of stuff happening, and this night. You know, it's a sneaky little night. This night, this this uh, this uh, night of ones, uh, but this night of ones is really good because. What he's doing, actually, you know, when I look back at it now, at this way, what he's doing, he's 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 bringing you to some place, ambition, a ambitious place. He's helping you to move with ambition in your life. So this is good because it's looking forward. Okay, so whatever is happening at your work, ambition, you're moving in ambition. You have um. Um, Confucius Confucius is the energy of the seven of swords confusion the energy of the seven of swords somebody is trying to get away with something you need to understand that you're the energy of the sword be you know there's a judgment of somebody just trying to get away with something and there's a judgment to it so you're going to find out about it and know about it so be um, away and be open up for information that is coming in because someone is trying to get away with something but do not let they do it because uh, it has to do with someone trying to do something and get away with it but it's not going to happen and this is the night of um, the sword people you are a sword person protect whatever it is because you're going to get information on Wednesday that the seven of swords that someone tried to get away with it and I want to know if they're going to get away with it or not are they going to get away with it are they going to get away with it whatever is happening are they going to get away with it yes or no no, they're not going to get away with it. You know, you, you know, it's as if, uh, see a me another message. No, you're seeing, you're not, it's as if some people, I ask if this night is going to get away with it. You're not seeing clearly and you need to find a way to start seeing clearly. I'm sorry, it's a hot day. <laughs> You need to find a way to see clearly. You know, it's as if you're sleeping. You need to wake up. Wake up and see what's going on around you. Wake up, people. Sometimes I have to wake up myself too. But whatever is happening, you're not seeing a situation clearly. 
and ask the universal angel whenever this thing is happening ask the universal angels um to show you positive um to show you what is going on around you okay we have temperance and the temperance has to do with the king of uh, coins the king of coins okay so whoever this king of coins is in your life you need to have temperance and balance on thursday with this person because this person is not really easy eh? be aware of who this person is because he's a sick person this person is emotionally imbalanced okay be aware of who this king of pen a uh, king of coins is because he's emotionally balanced so you need to have balance with this person whoever this it can be a taurus a virgo or a capricorn and i'm feeling more a taurus or a virgo energy because this man is a really sick little person okay so be aware of whatever is happening because you need to have balance with him so thursday is going to be a very good day that you find balance in whatever situation that is going on you really 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 need to have that balance because whatever is going on, somebody is trying and, you know, ask the universal angels, please let whosoever is trying to get away with something um, that they may be caught. So whosoever is trying to get away from, get away with something, they can either steal something, either going in your stuff, either using your stuff, either whatever it is, let them be caught. Okay. So call upon the universal angels. We're going to do this together. You're calling upon the universal universal angels your guiding angels and spirit guides whoever is trying to do something against me to get away with it whatever it is that is in just that somebody is trying to do call upon the universal angel ask your guides and angels for divine intervention so that this person will be found out and this person will be caught with whatever they're doing and trust me wait for seven days it's going to happen as we go forward, we have the energy vibration of debt and transformation. And this has to be, has to do with the six of pentacles. So if there was a situation where there was, um, you know, your materialistic need was not in order. It's going to get in order because there's a transformation that is coming in with your materialistic situation. And what is happening is that the six of pentacles gifts, gifts are going to come to you. Um, people are going to be gifting you with things. So it can be in money or you can be doing the same to someone else, but there's going to be a transformation. So let's say you as a person who don't give away anything, you're going to realize that people are going to be bringing you gifts and bringing you help and people coming in your life to do that on Friday. So whosoever you meet on Friday, if you meet a woman that is a Taurus, a Virgo or a Capricorn, on Friday, this woman is going to be very good. Um, it's as if the universe sent this woman in your life. And this woman is really going to help you with whatever situation. There's going to be a transformation come in your life. And this woman is really going to help you with whatever is going on. So if you were trying, you know, to get a business off the ground and need help, uh, this person is going to come in your life and it's going to happen for you. As we go forward, seven of pentacles. So you just had the six of pentacles. Now you have the seven. You have the world and the seven of pentacles. So whatsoever that you were planting, whatever, whatever you were planting, whatever you were trying in your life to get moving, it's going to start moving. So whenever the world comes up, there's going to be an end of whatever situation that was blocking you. The seven of pentacles, that means you have been working hard with a lot of stuff and you're going to see that with the energy of the seven of pentacles, that things are going to start to come your way now. Okay. So it's as if you have been working on something for a very, very long time. And now you are going to see that whatever the hard work that you have put in, in something is going to come out. So let's see what exactly it's going on with the seven of pentacles the queen of sword and the universe oh my god you got <laughs> you guys got the universe okay so this is going to be on saturday on saturday you had the energy of uh, the seven of pentacles and then you have the energy vibration of um the, the the queen of swords and the queen of swords is someone uh, is yourself so 
whatever and this is for the women whatever that was happening the world is coming out now whatever that was happening whatever situation that was taking place the world is coming out and what is happening is that universe so you have the universe twice so you know number 21 is going to be one of your energy vibration in this week you have the universe twice the universe came up twice so whatever is happening for you men ladies and gentlemen boys and girls in this week whatever you have been working harder on it's going to be a success the energy of the world came twice so write down number one number one the air is the 21 the energy of the world it's going to be a huge huge success as we go forward and look at Sunday we have the knight of cups he has been coming up this week whatever that you people need to work out with this Pisces cancer or um, um, our uh, scorpion you need to work it out and you have the energy of the Empress so um, there's a situation in your life say um, you knew someone you were with this woman and this was a child and um, this is what I'm getting for some people so let's say that you um, were with someone who is uh, um, the queen um, who is uh, the Taurus the Virgo or the Capricorn and they have uh, they have uh, um, a son or you ha you have a child with this person and the son is uh, um, the Pisces the cancer or the scorpion there is going to be a connection coming in whatever the situation is there is going to be a connection coming in with you guys okay whatever it is there is going to be a wonderful connection coming in with you guys and obviously I'm getting that if it was a, a, a mixed couple that you know you or um, a Caucasian and you were with uh, a woman that was uh, um, of brown uh, of brown I, I you know people give people name african-american and that sort of a thing I just think they're all brown or black and and uh, whatever it is whatever color but it's, it's, it's a situation with someone a Gemini and this is um, a man who had a relation or a woman who had a relationship uh, an interrelationship and the energy of this night of uh, cups was the energy vibration whatever is going to happen on Sunday there is going to be a connection it's as if sorry guys it is so hot it is as if there is going to be such a connection coming back with you three together and this is going to be extremely positive because you're going to realize that um, this this person you were the person who brought these two persons together and this is just profoundly wonderful because you know this is an example of um, you know situation that happened that people lose contact with each other and that's you know you Gemini's are always the one who wants to know uh, who wants to clear something and you are the one who went and have contact and find these people and put them back together and this is going to be wonderful you know it's going to be a wonderful week the number 21 is going to be one of your energies in this week and let's look and see what is number 21 because you have the world twice on Saturday so whatsoever is happening you have a situation um, that is happening and whatever you did whatever that you were working on you're going to see that the energy vibration of the universe comes in twice and this is going to be very positive the nights the nights are here so people between the ages of 18 and 35 you need to be aware in this week the number four energy is here twice so you have four and you have 21 um, four and 21 that is um, five four and 21 you know there's a situation you know whatever is going on the judgment that is happening and whatever is going on you know ask your angels and guides to show you the truth of whatever is going on I always do that I always say you know I I am confused and I'm I want to see I want to know the truth of whatever is going on and it always happened oh my god this is so beautiful for you Gemini forest 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 frolic made of the forest frolic made I 
acknowledge my inner child and open up my heart to the joy she brings I acknowledge my inner child and open up the joy that she brings so I acknowledge my inner child and open up the joy that she brings so whatever is happening this is so wonderful whatever is happening for you guys in this um, week is going to be very positive it's all about money you Gemini's is all about the money so let's see what's happening for you Gemini's uh, a change in the wind a change in the wind a change in the wind let's see where this change in the wind what is happening with this change in the wind what is happening with this change in the wind what is happening with the change in the wind a sense that unseen changes has been initial prepare for a storm awareness that your plans are not on firm ground feeling a shift uncertainty about which direction the wind, the wind will blow so it's human nature to yawn for certainty and risk and resist changes to to want the world to remember constantly like a zebra stripe yet nothing in human experience is black or white nor will it anytime remain static the one thing guarantee is change now is the time of transformation as outer conditions are temporary moving away out of sync with your desires and expectation stay the course and remember that even with every storm serve to clear the air scuffle scattered seed and nurture the soil for better things ahead life is about to go interested anticipating it will um, be curious as you wondered what is coming in on the shift winds the unknown is where the magic lies so it's not that bad it is not that bad so this is really a change because you have the the world so at end of the situation that is going to happen remember on Wednesday whatever the judgment is call upon your guides and angels and ask them to show you clarity and as they do that you will see clarity remember again <laughs> I love you so much. Please like and share these videos and listen to your sun, moon, and rising sign. And um, thumbs up, like, shares. Have a wonderful week. Whatever the situation is, money is going to flow to you and in different from out different different directions. It's all about money right here. <laughs> so um, I'm saying namaste until next time.